Well, in this hot weather, we're always looking for some relief. And in Pickerington, relief is coming in the form of flavored crushed ice. 10 TV's Bryant Somerville explains how it all started and how on days just like this, relief is spelled Y-U-M. It's gross outside. No other way to say it. It's sticky, it's sweaty, it's unpleasant. Come on, what, what do you got? Muggy. Um, terrible. <laughs> um, yeah. Lava. Steam. Humid. Deadly. Ooh, good one. Hot. You know what? Let's just let's just stop right there. It's hot, okay? It's hot. It is so hot. It's impressive. Almost as impressive as why all of these people on this hot day are standing in line waiting. What size would you guys like? Before she even opens. <laughs> Kayla Ferrant is 13. There you go. Have a nice day. And this snow cone endeavor started seven years ago when she and her brother Isaac wanted to run a lemonade and cookie stand. And that's when mom, I'm mom, gave her blessing. We were like, oh, mom, dad, we're sold out. And I was like, oh my gosh, you sold them all? And they were like, what? It all led, Kayla says, to the natural choice of a summer selection. And so then we thought, on a hot day, what does someone want? Snow cone. Brother Isaac did most of the heavy lifting. But last summer, he got a new, better paying job. So he handed down the ice machine to baby sister. Have a nice day. And this business model. Uh, definitely blue raspberry lemonade. Is taking off. Here's your spoon. A text system alerts more than 650 people when snow cones is open. Foot traffic, a constant steady. And in just a few days a week. 188. Kayla is cashing in. In two hours. 10% goes to giving, 20% goes to saving, the rest goes to the cost of operation. There you go. It's hot, it's sticky, it's gross, but maybe the word we should be using. And a snow cone is just the perfect of like cold, icy, and like still flavorful and good. Is delicious in Pickerington. There you go. Bryant Somerville. Of course. 10 TV News.